gosh, guys. I'm back. And yes, this is another Oculus video, and today I told you guys I wasn't going to do another video, but then it occurred to me I've been trying really hard to get Gary's mod to work. And guess what? Gary's mod appears to be working on the Oculus Rift. Oh, it's got head tracking. Oh, it's got head tracking. Oh my gosh, I am the happiest person in this entire chair. I, I promise you I am exactly that. Um, I think it's 3D. Oh gosh, it's hard to tell. If it is 3D, it's not as pronounced as I expected it would be. I think I can fix that. Now, how did I do this? Because if you've been a rifter and you've been interested in Gary's Mod, you've probably seen all the bad news about it. You would be correct. I am not running Gary's Mod natively with Rift support. Instead, I am using TriDef. But TriDef, does that have true Oculus Rift support? Kind of. It turns out they release some beta drivers, and that's what I'm running right now. The beta drivers actually add Oculus Rift support. And I found out by accident doing that last carrier command video that it kind of tries to work with anything it possibly can. And I'd run Gary's mod with TriDef before using anaglyphic 3D glasses. Don't ask why, I'm a boring person. But anyway, uh, I noticed the 3D did work with anaglyphic glasses. It's the red cyan colored ones. So I was thinking, hey, it'll probably work with, with uh, Gary's mod as well. And look! It does! Oh, it does, it does, it does. Okay, so we're actually in a map called Dream, which is kind of a scary map, so I might wet myself. Just note that I might wet myself. And uh, if you guys give me a second here, I'm going to try... Okay, folks, we're back, and I decided instead of uh, modifying the visibility and everything, that instead I would press all the wrong buttons and just crash Gary's mod. So that's what I did instead, and we're back from that, sorry. Um, I'm trying to get the field of view looking good, so that's what I was doing. Let's see if I can do this again without crashing Gary's mod like a moron. Um, this is going to be tough. Actually, it's working pretty well. Let's see if this works. It's a little bubbly. That I'm not a fan of, but I think we're going to be stuck with it. Let's see what else we can do. This is kind of me running some optimizations on it at the same time. Do we want to... Oh, that's... Kind of screwed up, but... Oh, wow, okay. Yeah, that's better. I don't like the fact that I can see my hand as well as I can. How's this? Let's see. I think that looks okay. I'm trying to get a balance. I like that a little... little eh, let's see with that, I guess. I'm trying to get a balance so we don't get too much of a, like, reverse fisheye, but at the same time, I don't want the, the hand to look weird. Okay, so... Let's see. Do I press all the right buttons? Yes, I do. Kind of have to take the rift off to see, because the, uh... The little... Uh, menu for TriDef is at the top left corner of the screen, and if you are a Rift veteran, you'll realize you cannot see what's up there. So, alright, let's prepare to get scared a bit. Don't know if I'm going to complete this, but oh gosh. Oh gosh, guys. I've actually already played this, but I've not played it like this before. It's a little frightening, I'm going to be honest. My lens is a little blurry. I think I need to clean it, but we're going to press on without it. Good news is I know how to win this. I'm going to do one more optimization real quick. You guys will thank me for this, assuming I can get it to work. Uh, I think it's in 3D. That's what I pressed. Don't press that. Um, is this it? Honestly, I can't even tell if that's working. We're going to leave that one. There's one. Copy FPS, quality's high, laser sight, output. Is this it? Overscan, I don't think that's... That's not really doing anything. Okay, come on. The head tracking I'm pretty happy with so far. Um, oh, world scale. I wonder if this does anything. Don't know. I don't think that's doing anything. Hmm. OSD depth? Oh wait, that might be doing a little something, it's hard to tell. Eh, we'll leave it like that. 
Yeah, I think that did something. Things look a little bit closer now. Okay. Here we go. Probably should have optimized this earlier. Water down there. I guess. This is a weird dream, man. This is a weird dream. Ah, I've been waiting for Gary's mom for so long. I probably shouldn't be playing with a gun, but... I am. Because I'm a chicken. Not like it matters, really. Because I don't think there's anything to shoot. It's purely because I feel much more capable with a weapon in my hand. Okay. Oh yeah, there's depth going on here. I feel like I'm going to run my head into this door. Ah, any of you rifters out there watching this video, is that weird? Does that scare you? Does that make you think I'm going to hit your head into it? Heh <laughs> I'm a horrible person. Alright. I think I remember how to do all this. This, you're in my way. You're in my way. You're in my way. There we go. We gotta get up there. It's actually pretty much easy to do. Just do this. The thing that was in my way. Pew. Pew. Huh. Fascinating. Oh, that looks depthy. Hmm. Kinda creepy. That's scary. So scary, in fact, I better take a second to intermission and talk a little bit about this because I'm pretty sure you guys are wanting to know how I got this completely working. And I told you guys it was Tridef. Uh, that's the ticket, really. And I'm trying to think if there's anything else you really need to do. Probably best just put it in a 17, or I'm sorry, 1200 by 800, I think is the native resolution of a rift. And as long as you have those drivers, yeah, this just pretty much just seems to work right out of the box. Um, I'll try to throw some links in the description for you guys. Oh, I remember what I was going to talk about, but it turned out it's actually for a different game. Uh, the other video that I was going to post online before my audio got eaten by my sound card was uh, whoa, another scary game, uh, Metro Last Light. And it looks amazing, by the way. But you have to do some tweaking to your configuration file. Uh, look up forcing it to DirectX 9. Oh gosh, oh gosh, things are happening. There's a train. Oh, there's a power. What is happening? I do not know. This looks important. Strangely enough, I like the fact that I can actually go up and down like this with my mouse. So many Rift demos get rid of that for some reason. Okay, I don't even... There's, like, no stars. That is creepy. No breaking. No hurting me. I am inside of a place. Huh. Can't hide from me. I can see what that is. That's right. Gordon Freeman, that to death. Alright, let's go in here. This is terrifying. Press all the buttons. At least there's a cop car. Press all the buttons. Uh, I'm gonna say that was probably not the button I wanted to press. That was a bad idea. That was the creepy sound button. soiled my pants. Okay. Is that open? Hello? Please, I want out. I want to be waked up from this nightmare. Apparently that one is screwed on. I like the last one. I see a message on the top left. I'm going to check that. Oh, you popped up again. Go away. Go away. Go away. There we go. Okay. Sorry about that. We shall continue. Don't have to be scary things. 
This is great. This is great. This is exactly what... Oh my gosh, I have Gary's mod support now. I'll tell you what, viewers. You guys go first. I'm not going that way. I have to go this way. I'm going this way first. Then. Maybe that wasn't a good idea. down here. Dude, seriously, the sound effects are amazing right now. Okay. This chair is directly in my way. For you. Is that pills? Lewis! Okay. You're in my way, too. Apparently, this is just a wet spot in the ground. So we don't want to... What am I hitting? Oh, lunch! Alright, I'm taking lunch with me. Ooh, disembodied fingers. This is good, right? Oh man. What's going on here? Is there anybody over here? I've been a tree. Ah, oh, I'm scaring myself with my own cans that I throw at things. How about you, tired? <laughs> I... What... What was that? That's... Not... Good... Right, okay. Um, we're out of here. Oh! A key! Spanish, I think I would be saying aki aki. Um, okay, that was terrible, sorry. And it was English. Ah, oh, the creepy sounds are gone. Very happy for this. I think that goes into the room that had the creepy button. I apologize in advance if there is a screamer. I will scream so loud, you will all go deaf. That's really scary. Okay. Let's go in here. Oh, it's really dark. Okay. Flashlight on or off? It's on. Okay. That's good. We're back here again. The computer? Do I have an old computer? Oh man. Don't have any DOS box for that. Alright. <laughs> okay, that was done. Oh, okay. I'm done. Um th thanks thanks for watching. Uh this map's my white light. I gotta go change my pants. See you later! Hey folks, before I go, I just wanted to say that I am having a lot of fun exploring the rift, and I said I wasn't going to do a lot of videos, but now that I've got Gary's Mod to work, I'm ecstatic. So, if you guys have any maps in Gary's Mod, preferably on the horror side of things, that you want me to do in the rift, or even otherwise, I'm totally cool with just doing regular videos too. Uh, let me know. Put them in the comments, and I might just do some. I'm considering doing other very interesting and scary videos, such as, oh, dare I say, I'm going to stay away from that one. Uh, let's go with Ghost Hunt. Ghost Hunt is a fun one. 
Oh, fine, I'll say it. I might consider Nightmare House. We'll see. I'll probably not sleep an entire week after that. But, uh, yeah, there's a few different options out there, and I, I've seen a lot of uh, pretty good, scary Gary's Bod uh, maps out there. So if you have one that's your favorite, you'd like me to do it, write something in comments. Let me know if you want me to rift it up or if you want to leave it plain. I'll do either. But just let me know. I like your input, and I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.